She shot to stratospheric fame in the 90s as one-fifth of the Spice Girls Who ruled the stage with their skimpy outfits and powerful girl power mantra But Victoria Beckham, 43 has admitted she dressed a little more demurely as a teenager and didn't wear inappropriate stage ensembles until she joined the band. Speaking in Vogue's historic December issue, the fashion designer also confessed her mother Jackie would never have let her go out in some of the group's scantier looks. Showing off a rare dress downside to her style, Victoria ditched the heels as she posed at her Hertfordshire house in a pair of checked pink pajamas for the shoot in the December issue which is the first under new editor Edward Annapol. Reflecting on her teenage dress sense, the mum of four mused, did I have a perm that was slightly distasteful? Yes. Did I wear strange jeans? Yes. Going on to discuss her revealing Spice Girls looks, she added, Did I look inappropriate ever? Not until the Spice Girls. My mom would never let me go out dressed like that. Doc Beckham also revealed she got her sartorial credentials from her glamorous mother Jackie, who would throw sumptuous dinner parties. We weren't allowed to attend, so we'd sit on the balcony and watch, she recalled. Mum had blonde hair and big shoulder pads, there was a lot of velvet, nipped in waists and 15 denier tights She was properly dressed for dinner. Since shooting to fame in the Spice Girls, Victoria has broken away from the group and established herself as a successful designer with a fashion empire Crediting her strong work ethic with her upbringing, she said, My family brought me up telling me I could achieve absolutely anything. Victoria, who shares Brooklyn, 18, Romeo, 15, Cruz and six-year-old Harper with husband David, said she applies the same mentality to her own brood. Whenever I said I can't do it, my dad just wouldn't hear it. He'd say what do you mean you can't do it? Why? Why? And I do that to my own children as well. The designer previously admitted she and her former Spice Girls bandmates Mel C, Jerry Horner and Emma Bunton looked like men in drag with their heavily applied makeup in the late 1990s. Victoria stated that she and her former bandmates looked hideous when they attended the American Music Awards in 1998 at which they picked up three prizes because they had piled on so much makeup Asked of her favorite Spice Girls beauty look, she said, when I was pregnant with Brooklyn, we did a video called Goodbye I had really short hair. That was quite nice natural makeup. But there's one that was the most hideous. We went to the American Music Awards and we looked like men in drag. We had so much makeup on, it was unbelievable. I look back at the pictures and I'm like, whoa. We took the layering of makeup to a whole new level. And Victoria admitted she cringes when she looks back at some of her Spice Girls looks. In a video interview with Selfridges presenter Laura Jackson, she said, I used to experiment a lot when I was younger, and I look back, from when I was in the Spice Girls, at some of those looks. Do I cringe? A little dot but I think it's great to experiment and try new things. The former singer previously shocked fans as she revealed how producers used to turn off her myth when she used to perform in the Spice Girls. They used to turn it off and just let the others sing. I got the last laugh, and now my neck is well and truly on, finally, she told Claudia Winkleman last summer. Victoria added that being the one who loved fashion in the world-famous band meant she could get designer dresses for free I was always the one that loved fashion, and it was quite a result for me, 
because the girls always used to get their clothes for free because they were crap and so there was a lot of budget for me to have my little Gucci dress, she confessed, 